Hi all, welcome back to another video. The Odoo 15 project module provides an excellent feature called Collaborative Pad, which will help you to work together and share individual ideas to accomplish success in company project and task. This feature will help the employees who are assigned a common task to collaborate on their work. So whenever we need assistance, assistance from your teammates, we can connect with them through this platform. So the history of your communication will be recorded in the system so that you can easily check the progress of your teamwork. And here you can review the contribution of each team member, give the instructions accordingly, clarify doubts and plan the next activity for the project using this collaborative pad. So the description tab of your task will be replaced by the collaborative pad in the project module. So here in this video, let's discuss about how to configure and use collaborative pad in Odoo 15 project module. For that goes to the module. And then to the configuration settings. So here in the task management section, we can see the collaborative pad. So we can enable the feature. It is to edit the task description collaboratively in real time to see each other's text in a distinct color. So we can save the changes before leaving the page. So here we can create new project or you can use the collaborative pad in the already created project and task in order. So we can uh, choose a project that have already created. So we can view the task. So while clicking edit, you can see the collaborative pad in the description tab. And here we can see a lot of options. So here we can provide a uh, description or you can simply type anything. Okay, and here we can choose the various uh, font like bold, uh, italic, underlined, or uh, strike through. And here we have the ordered list, so you can see the changes happening in the window uh, while in, uh, using this option. Likewise, we uh, likewise we have the unordered list, and here we have the uh, intent. Likewise, we have the outend. So here we can see uh, use the uh, redo or undo option. And here we can see a closed eye icon. So <clears throat> it is to uh, clear the authorship colors. So while uh, choosing the option, you can see the color have changed from the text. And here we can see the uh, switch pad. So here we can view it in the whole screen. Okay, when we comes to the uh, right side of the tab, we can see the uh, number of users in this pad and each user have given uh, different colors. So while clicking here, we can change the colors for the users. And here we have the uh, share and emptied, emptied this uh, pad option. So here we can share the link and URL. And also here we have the option to read only so we can set as read only and when we comes to the settings we can see the uh, options uh, to enable like chat always on screen show chat and users authorship colors line numbers read content from right to left and from here we can choose various font type likewise we can choose the language Here we have the save revision option. So the revision is now marked as a saved revision. So we can uh, see the saved revision by visiting the time slider. So here we have the time slider. So this option work the, uh, works as the same uh, as a video player. So using this option, we can convert the writings on the pad uh, into a video. So here we have the uh, option to play and pause the button. So 
so the return pad button can be used to go back to this pad. And here we have the uh, import or export option to transfer the data uh, to or from the uh, from the pad. So the uh, uh, here we can see the option to choose the file. Okay. And here we have the option to uh, simply start a chat. So using all this option, we can effectively communicate with the co-workers and the collaborative pad in the auto project module will solve the majority of issues that arise from the lack of communication while performing a task. So we have been discussing about how to configure and use collaborative pad in auto 15 project module. So that's all about the video. Thank you for watching.